Hello and welcome to an extended play of Far Cry 3 Blood Dragon. My name is Chris Bratt and I'm joined by Steve Burns. Hello. This is our first extended play together. It's, I know. It's a special I'm, moment. I'm excited. So excited. I'm excited to see what Blood Dragon's all about. It's it's just like Far Cry 3, but you know, now it's the 80s, but yeah. not because it's the future. Yeah, it's the 80s vision of the future. What? Who's this guy? Uh... And yeah, it's this has been kind of a weird one because it. It, like it got its official teaser trailer on April the first. Everyone wasn't sure if it was a kind of just an April Fool's joke or if they were actually going to go through with it. And yeah, yeah, it turns out here we are. It's not, it's not a DLC. It's a standalone game in its own right. Yeah, it's standalone. You don't need the. Uh, oh, there's the blood dragon. Oh, right, time to run away. You We've angered it. You can't beat the blood dragon. No. Yeah. Um. I think. It's, oh my day, what's going on? I need a car. <laughs> Everything's got very hectic. Yeah, awesome. new new rule, do not travel in the future past without a car. Mm -hmm. Good rule. So, yeah, it is uh, it is just Far Cry 3. Uh, I think it's more so than a lot of people thought it would be yeah. when they uh, kind of saw all the promotional stuff. Me, certainly. Yeah. But, uh, Could you bring the map up just for a second? Is that when you were just showing it beforehand? Um, yeah, like yeah. it's even got the kind of animals. Uh, yeah, but now they're hunting. now they're cyber animals. Dude. Cyber animals. Oh god! Come on now. <laughs> do you yeah. still hunt them for upgrades? That yeah, kind of you do. You still liberate the garrisons. We're off to to one now. Ah, okay. So, right. So it is. Yeah, it is exactly the same kind of setup. Yeah. Different island than Far Cry Three. Um, how, what what's it like in terms of scale? Is it quite a bit smaller? Uh, well, it's still fairly sizable, as you can as you can see here. Just lots of angry I've, red dots. Yeah, <laughs> looks like a bunch of nuclear explosions there. <laughs> looks like a seaboard after war games. But um, yeah, I'm enjoying it. Uh, I just I there's just certain parts of Far Cry 3's gameplay that don't really suit that kind of all-out action experience that they're selling. Got you. Like yeah. you're encouraged to be stealthy, uh, as you are in Far Cry uh, 3, the main game. But at the same time, this is a game where essentially you're given a minigun and it's like, yeah, now kill everything. Yeah, I see what you mean, because in Far Cry 3, the, it, I found it the most fun to play a kind of stealthy approach, but in this kind of action movie setting, yeah. so you, you want to run in with a machine gun. Yeah, I'm out of ammo in my minigun, well, so there you been, go. You've been playing it right. Yeah, <laughs> but you should never be out of ammo in your minigun. Right, That's okay. just, you know, and the enemies are quite stupid, as you can see there. He had a splitting head. <laughs> Yeah, it's full of full of nonsense like that. But what's the humour like? Have you are you enjoying it? Does it feel a bit forced? Yeah, I mean it's just essentially the greatest hits of the eighties. Mm. So there's loads of kind of you know um, there's loads of one liners taken from all the big action movies. The opening yeah. of the game has Long Tall Sally from uh, as you're in a helicopter from Predator. So yeah, this is the game, and I just think that yeah, while well, this is Far Cry Three was a lot of fun for a while, and this is fun at the moment. This isn't my final decision, or I, mean, right, I just okay. think, you okay. know, uh, I'd rather it was just a bit more linear. I'd rather just had a minigun with infinite ammo, <laughs> and I just went and killed everything well dead. I, yeah, I, I see what you mean. I, just, I do really like that they've decided to just make something that they thought was fun, though. I, I like that that is an option for the developers there. Yeah. It's like, we want to make an action, move, an action movie using the Far Cry 3 setting. Yeah, Let's fair enough. It. There we are. Now this is more yeah. like it. <laughs> yeah. So this is just just like when you're taking a kind of an enemy base in Far Cry 3, you you just need to. You, can you could you take this in a stealthy approach? Uh, yeah. If you wanted to. Totally but, stealthy. Because you get the bow. You still got the bow. Really? Oh right. Yeah. Still got the bow and all of that noise. So uh, I'll probably die here because you know. <laughs> Like, I like it's a very brave approach. Just drive up to the entrance. Well, it's a fun approach, them. isn't it? I mean, this is what the game is encouraging. Yeah. But at the same, you know, like I was saying, about the whole stealth aspect. What, what's the kind of uh, the narrative to it? Oh, is, come on now, come on, narrative. Is the what, you, what, what are you? You are Sergeant Rex, someone. Yeah. I think. Okay. Uh, it doesn't matter. I mean, it actually does not matter. Okay, You're Michael good. Bean or Bine or whatever from the Terminator. And uh, aliens as well. Yeah, your your Hicks, right? Cool. Um, and Kyle Reese, and this is your job. 
cool. to do oh, that, stuff like that's, that. That's the only explanation you really need. Yeah, uh, there is some some story, but it would it would you know make most GI Joe plot lines yeah. blush. So yeah, it's the future. America's been nuked. Um, everyone loves neon. Uh, yeah. Yeah. After we we uh, we watched Terminator Two very recently. Oh yeah. And I've yeah. been on a bit of an '80s binge since then. So I I do kind of like the idea of this. In Terminator Two, when we watched it, I was like, this isn't. You know, it's still a, a good movie, but I was like, some of this is so strange. <laughs> yeah, but I'm watching for a while. It's like it's like a comedy. Like yeah. if you saw the first Terminator and it's like. Um, and everything's so dark and it's like a bad fever dream where he's chasing <laughs> you. And then suddenly T2 is just like, it's comedy. I think most 80s movies are though, unless you're really drunk, they, they just make very little sense and wow. that's kind of the beauty of it. It's just yeah. you've got a lot of guns and there's bad guys and just maybe T2 suffers from being like a really early 90s movie when Arnie was in his bloody kindergarten cop phase where oh, he wasn't no. a bad guy anymore. You don't talk about that, man. Yeah, when he didn't kill everyone dead. And you're like, that's mental. Oh, man. He's over. So yeah, there's Far Cry. Nice yeah, I mean, all of this is very cool, you know. It's, yeah. You know, it's steel drums <laughs> and uh, and all of the kind of VHS effects over. Oh, who's this guy? Oh, it's all right. <laughs> I like he was about that's... to get dead. That's so, gone. is there any kind of uh, like an upgrade system like there was in Far Cry Three with a skill tree or anything like that? What's... I haven't encountered oh, one. Really? No. I'm not that far in. Um, yeah. But you can, you know, you do all this sort of thing. You hunt the animals yeah. uh, oh. as well, and I just need to. Look, I just need to upgrade my minigun. You can upgrade your weapons. All oh, right. Okay. Well, that, that, so. that's, I imagine that's it then. Yeah. Well, there's a VHS tape in here. Are the upgrades suitably ridiculous, or is it just more damage and that kind of? Yeah. Damages? Well, should be able to have a look here. So you can like pick up your weapons. The Phasertron. Uh, <laughs> I love yeah. that it's just called Bo. Like, yeah, There's all these Bo. super future names and then Bo. Well, yeah, the names are kind of like Galleria 1991 is Terminator 2 reference yeah. and AJM, I think Alex Murphy from Robocop. I mean, it's just, because there's a massive silence on it, but it's just like, <laughs> and Cobra Khan uh, is like in Robocop, I think. It's just it's one called the big. Cobra Assault Cannon. So, yeah, it's all cool. And it's, you know, if you're an a, if you're like a '90s kid who kind of grew up on like '80s movies or whatever, mm. you're gonna you're gonna love it. But uh, yeah, I just driving around and all of that. I just prefer it slightly, yeah, slightly more linear. But at the same time, you can just buy minigun rounds from a shop. So there's that. Oh, and you can pick up VHS tapes. Always important. Oh, you need to rent, rent them. What the hell? Oh, <laughs> amazing. <laughs> so let's. Uh... There we are. Now you've yeah. got ammo. Now we're talking. Oh, new skill, highwayman. So yeah, there is. Oh, I got you. Uh, breathe underwater and definitely cyber lungs, of course. Yeah. Better than regular lungs. So the, ah, so you just get these as you level up. You yeah. choose them. Okay. Well, well, that seems that way. I imagine. We, yeah, it, it's it is a smaller game. It's a standalone thing. Yeah. I guess it's, they're just trying to simplify that some. Yeah. Oh, let's go here. Let's go here. Is this the story mission that'll be or? Well, I don't know. We... Don't ask me. I'm only playing it. <laughs> Sorry, man. I'm only playing it and passing judgment on it. What should I need to know about exactly. this game? Oh. Look at that. Look at oh that. god, bit. The Far Cry 3 driving yeah. is is perhaps the most challenging part of the game. Yeah, I just like powering through stuff. <laughs> like, oh, come on, it's the future. Rocks. Rocks shouldn't exist. Future rocks. But yeah, okay. So, come on now. It's a very red looking game, isn't it? Lo yeah. Lots of reds going on. Yeah, it's the future. Everything is red. Soft the world been nuked. Oh, is it? oh, that's a shame. Yeah. Because, so, you know, if you've been to Japan recently, in, like, Hiroshima, it's all like this. Right, okay. The hostage it's, is under it's attack. just very red. Oh, 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 no. Oh, no. Yeah. They've killed... Oh, no, they will They're kill the hostage. Where's the... Oh, it's over. Yeah! You're an 80s action movie star. Yeah, I'm... But the hostage... The hostage doesn't die in the movies. That never happens. Exactly. See? Exactly. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, you know? I should be able to fly in there with a helicopter. 
and just shoot. I could just be firing indiscriminately. Yep. And it, you know, it would kill everyone but. I watched uh, Commando last oh, night. Just... Yeah, he throws a pipe through the enemies. It does, yeah, like he the bad guys. Throws a pipe chest. through a man's chest. Uh, no one seems to really care. His daughter, who witnesses it all, definitely will yep. have post-traumatic stress disorder. Uh, none of the movie makes any sense, which is why it's the greatest movie of all it, time. It really is. Yeah. Ah, so you slightly putrefied yeah. your bow. It's essentially just nail now. That's cool. That's cool. Oh, this is a lot of pressure. It's a lot of pressure. Nicely yeah. done. Nicely yeah. done. I thought he was going to stop and turn. You know how it is. Yeah. The AI just goes. I wonder what's over there. So, uh, so the, the, the game still retains that very cool Far Cry 3 infiltration mm -hmm. stuff. So, you know, yeah, it was just always. I found it always the best way to go was to try, at least try initially to sneak yeah. in before everything go goes. Terminator style. Until we weren't. <laughs> oh, cool. Yeah, there's a lot of nice little touches. Who's that guy? Uh oh. Well, he, lo he looks like he's. He's a heavy. He's a big guy. Where's the hostage? Hmm. But, um, yeah, I reckon. If you Essentially, if you love Far Cry 3 and you love action movies, yep. then you're fine. You're going to be fine here on him. It's good stuff. I personally gave up on Far Cry 3 uh, about. Or yep, same. I mean, I, I love like messing around in the world. The oh dear! Uh, where's the hostage? <laughs> oh no, no, no! Who's throwing that grenade? Which one's ah? I was going to say which one's the hostage? The one that isn't pointing a gun at you. Yeah, I really enjoyed Far Cry 3, um, as in roaming around and just doing nonsense. But I, I lost site with the, the campaign yeah, itself. Yeah, quite a lot. I was playing it on, on PC as well. It was amazing. Yeah. It was brilliant. It was the future. Mm -hmm. the future of games. But uh, there you go. I've saved him now. Nicely done. What is this shit? Yeah, I don't I think he's just swearing. <laughs> <laughs> is that the heel animation, I guess? Yeah. Nice. <laughs> One thing that did annoy me about the game is that it starts off with this tutorial and it takes the piss out of uh, there being tutorials, like, yeah. and the character references it and all the text references it, but it's still a tutorial. No, no. Not, <laughs> you can't just then skip it. It's like, you know, oh, okay. It's like, aren't tutorials yeah, terrible? But at the same time. He is mm. a tutorial. <laughs> okay, uh, yeah, so was that part of, was that just a, a side mission, that one, just the rescuing the hostage? Is that what you picked up from the... The yeah, base, just... I mean, like in Far Cry 3, there's loads of... Ah, yeah, there's okay. Hostage rescue, yeah. And then there's the garrison. These so... hostages, man, need to stop getting know, like, kidnapped. Why is, why is with people? Here's the... Oh, Blow stuff up here. Right, should we go up and take a look at that? Yeah, to, uh... yeah, it... Let's just drive. Let's just drive there. The open road. Beautiful. It's the spirit of America. <laughs> I don't know how we're going to get there. Yeah. Let's drive this way. You might, I don't think you can do it in one big straight line, unfortunately. No. Someone's Who's this put, guy? Is that a cyber animal? Yeah, dead. You, oh, no. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Right. You don't you're have mancy. time. He's oh. trying to rescue some hostages and blow some things up. Exactly. Let's go off road. This oh, is no. very this bad. Cool. Okay. never works oh, well. <laughs> it's all right. It's OK. It's full of oh. Everything is fine. Oh, dear. There's a bloody rock face. Yeah, this is this has gone really well. Yeah. It's alright, look. We're back. See? That was just lucky. Yeah. See if you did not know that was there. I, I <laughs> did. I saw it. What's the soundtrack like? Uh, we've obviously got the volume down a little bit. It's to, very commando, very kind of steel drum. You like it? it? Yeah, it's just funny. Alright, I've had to abandon <laughs> this and continue on foot. After oh, some, what's that? some pretty bad driving. Ah. That is great driving. Do the, do the cyber animals react any differently than the normal animals, or no, is they just reskinned? So. Yeah, it looks like they... But this what? One. It's all right. He's fine. <laughs> Apparently he can, no. can dodge bullets. Yeah. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh -oh. See ya. See ya. Right, there we are. All right, where's a car? I need to flag down. Oh, there's one. That's bad handy. Dude, I think you're going to have to get rid of them. Excuse me, can we borrow your 
mode of transportation. See ya. <laughs> there we are. Nicely done. Who says you can't be uh, subtle in this game? Exactly. Uh, just used a minigun to kill a boar. <laughs> that, that does kind of sell. Uh, Blood Dragon on its own, doesn't it? I just used a minigun to kill a boar. A cyber boar at that. Exactly. What What's the price like for, for Blood Dragon? Is it? 1200. 1200. I believe. Yeah. Oh my, what is this? Yeah, no, 1200 sounds right. Oh? Who's this? Someone's calling me. Oh no. Oh, no. We're trying, oh, I'm trying to drive. Trying to Blood Dragon. Oh my, oh, I'm sorry to everyone that's wasting their yeah. time watching so, this. You know, you know, before when you mentioned that you had seen the blood dragon and you ran away from it. Yeah. Is that? What is it? How how does that whole thing work? Well, you know. Do you encounter him early on and realise? Yeah. Oh, he's a the, he's a tough chap. One of the earlier kind of. Oh my God, one of the earlier missions is to kind of essentially get away from them. Uh, you can you might have noticed you can steal the kind of cyber hearts. Yeah. From which your is enemies, awesome. <laughs> which you throw to distract the. Uh, ah okay. Nah, so it's handy to keep a few hearts yeah. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> in your backpack. Rip a few hearts out. You cool. know, I find that's just a good rule for life. Yeah. Oh, oh god! Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Like a robot, like jumping over shit, yeah. running through mountains. Mm -hmm. But no. Oh dear! I don't want to fall down there. <gasps> there oh, it is. There he is. Yes. Okay, we'll cut back in here. Steve, we found a hang glider. And we may have crashed a couple of cars in the process, yeah. but I feel like we're really back on track now. Yeah, I feel that. You know, that's, it's all a big learning curve. <laughs> you know, the first one's always a warm-up. Yep. You know. But now you've got some no, got cyber, cyber glider. Cyber glider. Or exactly. just a normal glider. Yeah, that's, but if you say cool. cyber on the front of it... <laughs> it makes everything better. Yeah. Oh, this, this has worked out brilliantly. Yeah, I might crash this and die. Don't worry, oh, yeah, here's, the fucking, here's the magic. Oh, oh beautiful. See ya. <laughs> Everyone get down. Who's this guy? Come on, man. Come on, come on, guys. Did you not see me just arrive in a hang glider? You know I'm the protagonist here. He won't die for some reason. Oh, God. Oh, God. No. I can't relax. There we are, good stuff. So what are we doing here, do you know? Uh, is we need to blow something up? That, yeah, actually, blow, that was the only, was the objective, the only objective that we had. I kind of, I do like the enemies and that because, you know, G.I. Joe. Yeah. This is, this is a game that's targeting me, essentially. Mm -hmm. Did you watch Predator when you were four years old? Yep. Yep. Yeah, that's illegal. Then. Yep. Don't worry about it. So yeah, there you go, there's Cyber Heart. That, it pretty that's much shaped fun. you as a man, didn't it? Obviously, I mean, it did everyone from yeah. era. So, okay. Not like you kids. No. I, I watched Predator. Big, yeah, I like but, Predator. You know. I just watched it a little bit later, that's yeah. all. <laughs> <laughs> you you, goddamn 80s hipsters. A lot of I you. I say, you know, I've got VHS tape around my neck <laughs> all the time. You know. Yep. God. Is that VHS? My phone, Predator. My phone looks like a Game Boy. <laughs> yeah, this guy, he doesn't mind. No, nope, he's cool. Yeah, he's. Like, he's... Hmm, the guys upstairs have been quiet. Oh, yeah. God, what the. What? And that, he, him over there as well. Come in, Doc. A few warning shots, I like it. Yeah, this isn't the most accurate gun. It's not just a nursery. <clears throat> but it's the coolest gun. I feel we're missing important plot elements mm -hmm. here. It, we we need to know all the backstory of what you're about to blow up. Yeah, we don't. Consumables. Yeah, get that. Body armor. Get those. Oh yeah. They're loads. Yeah. All the nano med probes. They sound really they quite uncomfortable. Nice. Nice. These guys don't stand a chance. Oh god, oh god, <laughs> maybe they do. They, they use their cyber skills to dodge <laughs> all of your bullets. Yeah. Oh no. See, oh yeah, okay. <laughs> I just occasionally glance down at the subtitles and there's just so many None confusing words. But it just it, yeah, feels a little bit better. Oh, who's this guy? Come on now. He's dead. That's who he is. He's dead. That's, there we are. 
<laughs> yeah. Good, good grenade for there. Excuse me. Precarious. Throw grenade, throw grenade. Yeah, yeah. Get out, get out. Nice. There we are. This gun takes ages to fire. Yeah. This gun's got to go down. Yeah. Good mini gun. Whoa. Oh, is that, is that one of the things that you yeah. normally run away from? Yeah. Could you. Is it literally impossible to kill him at the moment? Uh, no. But it's just very difficult. You distract it with the hearts and then you just shoot it. Right, okay. But it takes quite a lot of... Any advantage of killing them, like seeking them out? Yeah, it's kind of like you get loads of stuff for it, but... Oh, that's good. Yeah. Oh, cool stuff. What's going on here? I don't want to... And lasers come out of his eyes. Oh, just, yikes. Uh, yeah. Hey, dude. Excuse oh, God. Stop doing that. See? Okay. Oh, you've only dented his. That is a tough dragon. That's He's worst, worst flamethrower. Worst <laughs> well, on that worst note, Steve, it's been a pleasure. I'll leave you to uh, continue your playthrough. Is there a review coming up for Blood Dragon at some point? Yes. Good tomorrow. stuff. Well, we shall look forward to that. Or today. Depends on this guy. I don't know. You tell me. And now I'm dead. <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> 3 out of 10. <laughs>